Remember we filmed my mature male Leedzy, you guys, the Cyrocosmos Leedzy, which is kind of like the same genus, the same family, same cousin as my heartbutt tarantula, the Cyrocosmos elegans. Thank goodness my Cyrocosmos elegans is a confirmed female, but unfortunately that mature male Leedzy did not make it. So as you can see over there, he is dead. If, if you're wondering why, it's because mature males, for those who don't know, mature males don't live very long. And as you can see down there, there are mites. Now these mites are are not the mites that would attack a tarantula as when it's alive. You can see over here, let me just get this guy up. Let me see, sorry, it's not focusing. Dang it, phone! But yeah, here is the poor guy. Now I have asked in so many Facebook groups asking if anyone has like a mature female for this guy, but unfortunately no one had a female. So he just, unfortunately he, he had to die a virgin, but yeah. Uh, I, I don't know because this, uh, I, I really, I don't know what to do in this video. I just wanted to show you guys because mature males like this guy over here, I was so hoping that he was going to be a female and you can see the mites. Dang. Now I have no idea how these mites appear because this thing over here, as you can see the holes, they are, yeah, I, can, I guess they're decently sized. But really, I don't know how the mites came because the tarantula was in here like perfectly fine without any mites. And I never introduced any mites. I never fed anything to it with mites. It just, every time when a tarantula dies, in my hands they'll just the next day be covered in these weird looking mites which i am not quite sure how they come like look at this guy over here he is like i want to squish a mite i want to just squish one and see what oh ew. yep there we go i just squished a mite <laughs> well yeah guys um unfortunately this guy didn't get to mate but it's just all part of tarantula keeping it's not like i can release him into the wild and for him to find a mate no these guys are not local to my area so yeah, I guess that is just a quick, I wouldn't say update, but just some quick video, I guess, to show you guys what happened to this little guy. Hmm. Yeah. So if you guys have matured males and they just randomly pass away, please don't feel bad because that's what mature males are all about. I don't know why nature intended nature. Nature intended for them to just die off at such a quick, I don't know, a quick rate but it's just the way it is so this guy unfortunately since it is covered in mites since he is covered in mites i will not be able to preserve him because the mites have already eaten quite a bit of him so we're just going oh what is that what is this one yo you are not a mite you are just some rent oh yeah i think it's a mite i think it's just a skinny mite <laughs> well yeah wait is it alive oh uh, I, I thought the tarantula was still alive but no you guys this is yeah it let me let me just smell it yep no smell you guys no smell so so this guy, he probably passed away like yesterday and today it's just full of mites. So unfortunately, I will not be able to preserve him because like I mentioned, the mites have already eaten like almost all of his body. Like probably all the meat inside are all gone. But if I found him dead earlier without before the mites all came, then I would probably have preserved him as a wet specimen. But unfortunately, because... The mites are here. I'm not able to do that. And also because I'm kind of li a little bit bumped because it is pretty rare to find a Sarcosmus Leedzy over here. And the one that I got became a matured male and just died. And also I'm also bumped because I am not able to preserve my only Leedzy because these mites, like seriously, how the hell, where do they come from? Like I keep this in my room, like in my room. And my room is free of mites. Like these guys, they just, they just appear out of nowhere. Like look at the sub straight it is literally like mite free right mite free i mean if you look at that then it's definitely from the tarantula but in general it is mite free so i have no clue where these guys come from but yeah that's just a short video just a short update so i guess i'll see you guys in the next video take care and peace <laughs> Sorry, this was just a very short video. Just wanted to show you guys this. So yeah, stay tuned for next video. I promise it'll be, maybe I wouldn't say much longer, but slightly longer. I mean, at least it's a little bit longer, right? I didn't know. All right, see ya. <laughs> And also sorry for the lighting because, I mean, I apologize for that for almost all of my videos because I'm using my iPhone 7. And uh, yeah, I'm going to be using my iPhone 7. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> I guess I'll just toss this, I mean, in the bin because, I mean, like I said, no use for me. Yeah, I can't preserve it. I literally, I can't do anything with this tarantula. So I guess I'll just toss it into the box over here and just throw it out later. See you, dude. And then I will use this container for another sling in the future, I guess.